LipSense is the revolutionary new lipstick that's not only smudge resistant, but also hydrates the lips, giving them a healthier, happier appearance. In order to achieve the complete durability and rich color of LipSense, there are a couple steps to consider while applying. Start by gently cleaning your lips with a warm, damp washcloth and dry with a towel. Pay particular attention to drying the waterline. This is the most difficult part of the lip to get to keep color, so starting with a dry base is crucial. For an even and clumpless color, shake the vial five to 10 times before applying. Lip Sense is applied using thin layers and long strokes instead of the traditional back and forth method recommended by other lipsticks and gloss. Start on the upper lip at the tip of Cupid's bow and make one long stroke down to the corner of your mouth. Continue by making another stroke just below the first. Repeat the process for the other half of the lip. Be sure to re-dip your wand between strokes to maintain even coverage. For your bottom lip, start at the corner of your mouth and make one long stroke toward the center. Continue by making another stroke directly above the first, filling in the waterline. Repeat for the other half of your bottom lip. You may notice a tingling sensation when first using lip scents. This is completely normal as the base of the color is a denatured alcohol that serves as the delivery system for the color. It will be more noticeable when your lips are dry or cracked, but will go away as your lips become healthier and more moisturized with the use of the LipSense glosses. Allow your first layer to dry by waiting 15 to 30 seconds before applying your next layer. Wait time varies as some colors require longer to dry than others. Do not press or smack your lips during color application. Doing so can ruin color evenness. Apply your next layer in the same fashion as the first, using the same color or mix it up with a different color for a desired effect. Allow the second layer to dry and apply a third layer of color. Do not apply more than three layers of color. Too many layers cause the color to flake and peel more easily. After your third layer is dry, apply a coat of glossy gloss to seal in the color. Additional glosses may be worn for various effects. Allow the first coat of glossy to dry for several minutes before removing or applying a different gloss over the top. Now feel free to press and smack lips together to even out the gloss. Please note, glosses and chapsticks by other manufacturers can break down color adhesion faster. When first using lip scents, you will notice that color is lost as your lips peel or exfoliate naturally throughout the day. This is a normal process and takes anywhere from two to four weeks to resolve, but stick with it. After the initial exfoliation phase is complete, your color will last much longer, your lips will become much healthier and more moisturized. Here are some tips to get you through the exfoliation phase. Wax-based products such as chapstick or other lipsticks can be very drying for your lips and can extend the length of time your body experiences the exfoliation phase. Gently exfoliate your lips in the evening with sugar scrub and a warm washcloth. Wear glossy gloss or Senegens moisturizing balm while you sleep. Senegens has designed the Oops Remover as the suggested method for removal, touch-ups, and mistakes. Facial makeup remover bars can be used to remove any residual pigment without traumatic scrubbing of your lips. That's it. Everything you need to know about LipSense to get you started having kisses as resilient as you are.